situation in which damaged skeletal muscle tissue breaks down rapidly. Breakdown products of damaged muscle cells are released into the blood stream. Some of these, such as the protein myoglobin, are harmful to the kidneys and may lead to kidney failure. The severity of the symptoms, which may include muscle pains, vomiting and confusion, depends on the extent of muscle damage and where the kidney failure develops. The muscle damage may be caused by physical factors, medications, drug abuse, and infections. Some people have a hereditary muscle condition that increases the risk of rhabdomyolysis. The diagnosis is usually made with blood tests and urinalysis. The mainstay of treatment is generous quantities of intravenous fluids, but may include dialysis or hemofiltration in more severe cases. Rhabdomyolysis and its complications are significant problems for those injured in disasters such as earthquakes and bombings. Relief efforts in areas struck by earthquakes often include medical teams with the skills and equipment to treat survivors with rhabdomyolysis. The disease was first described in the 20th century, and important discoveries as to its mechanism were made during the Blitz of London in 1941. Horses may also suffer from rhabdomyolysis from a variety of causes. Signs and Symptoms the symptoms of rhabdomyolysis depend on the severity of the condition and where the kidney failure develops. Milder forms of rhabdomyolysis may not cause any muscle symptoms, and the diagnosis is based on abnormal blood tests in the context of other problems. More severe rhabdomyolysis is characterized by muscle pain, tenderness, weakness and swelling of the affected muscles. If the swelling is very rapid, as may happen after someone is released from under a collapsed building, the movement of fluid from the blood stream into damaged muscle may cause low blood pressure and shock. Other symptoms are nonspecific and result either from the consequences of muscle tissue breakdown or from the condition that originally led to the muscle breakdown. Release of the components of muscle tissue into the blood stream causes disturbances in electrolytes, which can lead to nausea vomiting, confusion, coma or abnormal heart rate and rhythm. The urine may be dark, often described as tea-colored, due to the presence of myoglobin. Damage to the kidneys may give rise to decreased or absent urine production, usually 12 to 24 hours after the initial muscle damage.